How are you guys? Figured I'd share a uh, free tip Friday with you, and um, I think this one's been road tested long enough that hopefully it's worthwhile. So about, I don't know, eight years ago, I was uh, working as an engineer. I spent, you know, 40 to 50 or plus hours a week in AutoCAD and Microvelm, and I would be sitting like this, and at the time I had a standard keyboard, um, something a little more like this, and I was constantly going back and forth from the number pad to my mouse. And I wanted to be more efficient, and so I had looked up and I ordered a um, separate number pad that I set over here. That way I could have my left hand on the number pad and keep my right hand on the mouse. Um, fast forward a couple years, and then I found this guy, and this was probably $20 or $30 on Amazon. Um, and it's a left-handed keyboard, so it's got the number pad here on the left-hand side. Um, and so I'm able to kind of stay pretty efficient when I'm working in AutoCAD. Um, and you're entering a lot of measurements, um, typing in numbers, and even beyond that now I've set up some shortcut keys. So keeping your right hand on the mouse, left hand on the number pad. Way more efficient. Um, and I've been using this now for probably six or seven years. This same exact keyboard, actually. I had um, invested in a, a higher-end uh, bloody mechanical keyboard that they make in a left-hand version. But I've come back to this one. The keys feels nice. I like this layout. And um, it's not too loud. So um, if you spend a lot of time in front of the computer like I do, and you're entering numbers... Um, even if you're working in spreadsheets, Excel, um, anything of the like, having a left-handed and, and your right-handed mouse user, um, getting a left-handed keyboard is a huge improvement. Hope this helps.